Hi, I'm Lee Livingood. I'm the clarinet and bass clarinet in the Utah Symphony, and here I am in beautiful Haiti. We've been having a wonderful time, and I'm blessed with seven clarinet students from Haiti. Uh, they're very eager, very interesting people to work with. Uh, we're, we've been having a great time working on the music and clarinet fundamentals and working with reeds and all of that kind of stuff, so it's been a really interesting time and a, a great adventure to be here working with the kids. And how has the language barrier been? Do you have any English speakers in your group? Or? I'm lucky to have a couple of English speakers in the group. I have a little bit of my schoolboy French that I use that Excellent. gets us through some things. Um, so the language barrier hasn't been too bad for my group. And how have you um, found their instruments and reeds and stuff like that? The uh, instrument and equipment situation here is fairly dire. Most of the kids had a reed to use, um, usually old and in not very good condition. And the instruments, some are serviceable. One student was totally unplayable. Uh, but how, how many reeds does a, a normal student in the U.S. have? Like, what, what is the normal number? Um, I always, my students will always have a couple of boxes, which is 20. Wow. And I make sure that they have five or six that are working always at any given time. I so, see. So one is very little. So one is very, very little. Yeah. And what do you think of the country and the climate and all the rest? The, the climate here is beautiful. Um, in the country, it's, it's very different for an American who hasn't traveled to a country like this before. A lot of things we take for granted, um, you, you certainly can't here. Though we're lucky to stay in a very lovely hotel, but when you see how a lot of the Haitians live, it's a very different, much harder life than what we're used to. Thanks, Lee. Thank you, Yuki. Bye.